Hey guys, welcome to Bruno, and Bruno is about time with other messages. So if these messages resonate with you, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, you guys. So I am getting, I'm getting, um, I've been thinking about you for quite a while. You're on my mind every day and every night. My every thought is you. The things you do seem so satisfying to me. I must confess it, girl. Ooh, I like it. Mm -hmm. I done got in the groove. You send chills up my spine. You. Could be a queen of swords energy here. Somebody who's very intelligent, very sophisticated, okay? Very strong-willed type of person here. Very intuitive, okay? I'm getting sapiosexual type of energy. Somebody is like obsessed with your intelligence here, okay? You may dress really nice here. Yeah, somebody is like, they see a compatibility here, okay? Knight of Wands energy, okay? So I'm getting someone is so like, I'm getting someone is like into you, okay? They think about you all day and night, dream about you, daydream about you, okay? Okay, this is somebody who probably daydream, daydream of what life would be with you. I'm getting this energy like this person must watch you. I'm getting the, they like what you do, okay? Maybe like what you do for work or or they like how you handle situations here or how you handle a situation here or how you handle yourself, okay? Two of Cups. This is somebody who looks at you as somebody who is very compatible. They want a relationship with you. Yeah, this Knight of Wands energy. This is somebody who wants to heal something with you, okay? Yeah, I'm getting... Um, yeah, they may. This is somebody who who likes how they care, how you carry yourself. Very satisfying to watch you. Okay. Yeah, you got the Queen of Swords again. Look at this. Wow. Okay, I'm getting somebody. You may be easy on the eyes for this person, or you make something look so easy. Okay, it's probably how you handle a situation or how you handle work. Like something may be hard for them. Or you make it look, if somebody, something is may, may be hard for them or hard for them to understand, you make it look more easy, more appealing, or more satisfying. I'm getting someone maybe, maybe, maybe trying to step into your shoes or may, tr may step into your shoes and realize whatever you do is really not easy at all. It's actually, it's really a lot of thought process into it okay with this queen of needles here i feel like and maybe they admire the fact that you make something that's that looks so hard or something that's so hard to accomplish looks so easy and at ease here okay i'm getting a very loving nurturing type of energy um as well even though i'm getting this queen of swords energy right here i feel like you are somebody who is very loving and very nurturing could be a mother figure type or a sister, okay? Someone who sets a lot of positive examples for others, okay? I feel like you may be sitting on some type of throne or you have some type of, um, you, you, I'm getting a seat at the table here, okay? Spiritually, okay? Um, I feel like you set a lot of positive examples for other and it's your intelligence here. It's how you think things out or how you think things through here, okay? Someone has an understanding of life or they're very understanding and cooperative type of person okay healing type of energy here i feel like you have a cooperative attitude here okay um you could be a therapist or you could be a psychiatrist or some type of or you could be in that type of energy here you may uplift uh, this person or you may be in this position of uplifting other people here you may uplift this person when they're actually sad or when they're down. It's like you're holding someone's hand and guiding them to overcome some type of obstacles or troubles. And you do this at ease. I'm getting um, Empress High Priestess vibes as well, okay, with this 
um, Queen of Swords energy here. Okay, with this whole overall energy here, this is somebody who they they want to have a relationship with you here. Okay, this is this Knight of Wands energy. You got two of, two of potions, Knight of Candles, and Temperance here. Okay, this is somebody who sees the compatibility with you. I'm getting sapiosexual. This uh, I'm seeing a rocket again. Okay. Um, on my last reading, I got an energy of a rocket. So I'm getting like, this is somebody who is like shooting up. Their energy is shooting up like a rocket. They they look at you as somebody who they want to have a relationship with. They see you as their compatibility. I feel like they look at you as somebody who they want to start a new creation with, a new relationship with. Somebody is in turn on by your um your intelligence here okay they find you very attractive with this knight of wands energy this is somebody who is ready to come in and sweep you off your feet this is somebody who wants to heal something with you they want to balance something with you they look at you as their peace and like i said this is probably somebody who probably um put their self into your shoes okay because i feel like this is somebody who is looking at things at another perspective here they may look at you as their soulmate here okay they changed. This is somebody who has healed. Now, I feel like this is somebody who probably um, changed how they see a situation here. They look at you as somebody who is very divine, very intuitive, okay? I feel like um, I'm getting this energy like you probably break things down for this person or you break things down for people. You look at things in another perspective and I feel like this person is seeing that about you here. Okay, you could be somebody who is a little guarded here. Okay, yeah, I feel like this person look at you as a, a high honor or a high stature, and it's, it's, it has a lot to do with your intelligence here. Okay, I feel like you are very content, is what I'm getting here. Okay. Now with this queen of, queen of Needles, you got the Queen of Needles, Ace of Potions, and you got the Ace of Presents. You got two Aces here. So I feel like this is something that's very new. This is a new beginning here. Whoever this Queen of Swords is, this could be you. I feel like somebody may be in love with you or there's about to be some type of new relationship or new romance coming into fruition here, okay? I feel like somebody has love for you, okay? I feel like this is a message in a bottle here. Okay, this is somebody who wants to have a new beginning with you, a financial new beginning, probably family planning. This is probably somebody who wants to have a new creation with you, a new family creation with you. Okay, um, this is actually really beautiful here. Okay, um, yeah, I'm strongly getting very sapiosexual type of energy. Okay, it's about your state of mind is what I'm getting here. Okay, your state of mind turns somebody on here. Okay. I've been thinking about you for quite a while. That song got me in a groove. I feel like something is like shooting up like a rocket here. I'm still seeing that rocket here. Oh, I'm actually seeing two. That's so funny. I'm seeing two of them. Now. So two of them, two, two rockets are shooting up. I feel like this is a mutual type of energy here. A mutual feeling towards two people here is what I'm getting here. I'm strongly getting somebody may be actually intelligent as well. It may be, yeah, this person wants to come in and give you some type of offer here, okay? And I feel like maybe this person probably had a hard time with um, meeting somebody who is at their stature here. What I mean stature is like their intelligence here. Your intelligence is like through the roof here with this queen of needles here. I feel like you are very thoughtful. You think things through here. Okay, and I feel like that really turns somebody on here. Okay, you got ace, ace here. Surprised I don't see the ace of wands, but the reason why I don't see the ace of wands here is because somebody is literally, I'm getting sapiosexual type of energy. This person loves your healing, intelligent energy here. Okay, tell me more about this queen of swords here. Okay, very beautiful type of energy here okay i feel like this person trusts you with decisions here okay decision making okay if you guys would do something together because this is something that's going to be done together here okay this is like your partner here your partner in crime here two of cups here okay I feel like somebody has realized or somebody is feeling like they met their match here 
your state of mind, your intelligence is turning someone on. They're so into you. Like, this is like hot, okay? Yeah, I'm seeing good luck and success. Somebody has clarity that this is what they want or they have clarity that you are this queen of swords and I'm about to say intuition. Your intuition is just like on point here, okay? The devil. So somebody, this may be somebody from your past, okay? This may be somebody who looks at you in this type of energy here. They may be actually addicted and obsessed with you. I'm sure we getting, um, this may be both of you guys, okay? I'm getting a very obsessive type of energy here. Maybe you guys are obsessed with each other. Like I said, this is uh, two people who probably are intelligent. Uh, maybe this person is dependent on your energy, okay? There's some type of bondage here that this person is obsessed with and addicted to, okay? This person may be... Um, I'm strongly getting like this person may be having some type of tower moment here, okay? This is like a um, a realization, okay? This is like an unexpected change. I don't think this person was ready for this type of energy, but I'm, I'm getting this person um, is realizing that they can't move on from you, okay? This person is in love with this Ace of Cups here. Tell me more about this Ace of Cups here. Yeah, I'm getting... Maybe this person maybe tried to move on and probably meet somebody meet somebody else or meet other people, but this person probably kept running into crash dummies or something like that. I'm getting crash dummies. Will of Fortune here. Okay, somebody done learned the karmic lesson and is about love here. Yeah, like I said before this card came out, I feel like somebody may have tried to date other people and I feel like this person kept running into a bunch of crash dummies, okay? And I feel like that's what they are realizing that they are in love with you. No one can actually replace you here, okay? Because this person has got the Six of Wands and the Knight of Wands here. This person is, they want victory and success with you, okay? Somebody may have kind of like hurt their own feelings by dealing with other people who were basically probably beneath them. They wasn't really satisfied in that energy. I think somebody is just awakening to the fact that they're a sapiosexual or they're in love with people who are very intelligent here. They find you very attractive here. You may be, uh, you may be actually this wounded warrior and his energy here. I feel like this is somebody who wants nothing but victory and success with you. Okay. Um, this could be somebody who was in and out of your life, somebody who um, they come in and sweep you off your feet and then they out the door, like a very indecisive type of energy, very teenage type of energy. Tell me more about this Ace of Presence here, which is the Ace of Pentacles, okay? Yeah, okay. I feel like this person wants this new beginning with you. This is somebody who is holding on to this idea here of having this new beginning with you here. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody who they want this new beginning with here with here. They want this new beginning with you, but I feel like there's some type of blockage here. Okay. I feel like um I don't know what the blockage is. I feel like this person is still disappointed of not moving forward with you. Okay. Like I said, this could be somebody who probably was in and out of your life, and I feel like Something is a blockage here. You Somebody can't get through here. I feel like you're probably tired of this energy or somebody's tired of this energy, but they're still holding on to you, okay? Holding on to you. This person may have let you down or disappointed you in some type of way by not moving forward with you, okay? In some type of way. There was no movement forward here, okay? Tell me more about this Ace of Pentacles, please. Yeah. But I, I feel like this person is probably not moving. Maybe they're they're dealing with their karma or they're learning some type of karmic lesson. But I feel like the obsession is still there. This is like some type of bondage that somebody is like obsessed with or they're addicted to have this bondage with you, okay? But there is some type of blockage here, okay? There's a strong compatibility in this connection here, okay? This person is really into you for sure, Okay? Six of Swords in reverse, Knight of Pentacles in reverse, and the Six of Cups in reverse. Yeah, I feel like maybe this is you actually being in this defensive type of energy here. I feel like you are 
being very defensive here. Could be very withdrawn, could be blocking somebody here. I feel like you're standing up for yourself is what I'm getting here. Because this is probably somebody who probably is in and out of your life here. Okay? I feel like you kind of like... Like you're, you're healing from something from the past. Maybe what this person has done for you in the past. I'm getting like this person may have procrastinated with you or they didn't um, take the, they didn't take the right, they didn't plan with you or they didn't make the right judgment towards you. Okay. They didn't make no movements towards you here. And I feel like you're kind of still stuck on that past type of energy here. It's, you're, you're still trapped in your mind about this energy here. You're not sure if this person is going to come in and do the same thing. Okay. You're, you're, you're still probably healing from whatever this person did. You may get reminded of that type of energy here. Okay. So I'm getting this energy like you're very defensive in this energy here. Okay. 15 on the clock, but I feel like you, you, you still, I'm, I'm getting this energy that two people are still addicted and obsessed with each other. I'm going to pull from the romance angels here. Yeah. I feel like whoever this is, I feel like they're kind of like, they're stuck in their traps or they can't move here. And it's because there is a blockage here. Okay. Somebody needs to, um, get out of this negative mindset about this person okay i'm strongly getting like there's a love here but there's a there's a karmic lesson that needed that that was learned here okay yeah i feel like somebody is getting a reality check what are you getting a reality check about yeah somebody didn't invest in this connection here and they may want to come in and apologize yep Somebody wants to come and apologize, okay? They want to communicate because somebody wants to have a new beginning with you, okay? They want to build with you. This could be a king of wands energy, okay? This person wants to take action towards this high priestess, queen of cups. And I said high priestess. This is a queen, high priestess, queen of cups, and queen of swords energy here, okay? Oh, God. Oh, goodness. You're a healer here. This person wants a fresh start with you, okay? This is a very healing type of energy. Somebody wants to come back and heal this connection, but I feel like you're in some type of defensive type of energy here. Okay. I mean, it happens. I feel like you're in this protective type of energy here. You may already know that this person, you may already know that this person is your, your soulmate here. And maybe this person is a little late with finding that out here. Okay. And I feel like you're just being cautious. There's nothing wrong with that. You're just being cautious in this energy. You just want to make sure that this person is aware that... Maybe you just want to make sure that this person is aware that they know that y'all are soulmates here. But y'all souls is like... Y'all both addicted to each other. Y'all both obsessed with each other. Okay. Maybe you both need to get out of some type of negative mindset. Okay. That's what I'm getting here. Okay. And I feel like this is kind of like, I'm getting this energy like this is like this energy kind of like fading off here. Reconciliation. Saw that pop out. Past life relationship. You have known each other before. Okay. I feel like you guys already spent past lives together. Okay. Okay. 18 on the clock. I feel like this is your intuition speaking to you. Reconciliation here, okay? Someone from your past is returning to your life, okay? This is a reconciliation for sure here. I feel like both of you guys really love each other. I feel like this is a reconciliation just wanting to happen here, okay? I'm going to pull from the meditation messages here. And I'm going to pull... I don't know. I didn't, even, I didn't stop counting here. Okay, Taurus, Neptune, somebody got Neptune and Taurus here, Aries, Sun, this is about an Aries here, an Aries Sun sign, strong Aries energy here, okay, somebody got Sagittarius in their ninth house here, Aquarius in their fifth house here, got Aquarius, Aries energy, Sagittarius, Taurus energy here, subscription, okay, 
something about a subscription here. Maybe this is a, a subscription of this person or you actually subscribing to somebody's life here. Okay, is what I'm getting here. Too many cooks in the kitchen. Okay, that may be... That may be what the issues was, okay? It was too many cooks in somebody's kitchen here, and that's why you're still holding on to some type of negative past here or negative mindset about this person here. This person probably procrastinated in a relationship or it may have been some troubles in some type of connection that was supposed to start or some type of plan that was supposed to start with you guys, but it was too many cooks in the kitchen here. It landed right on that. So that's de definitely what it was. And I feel like that was your mindset here. I feel like somebody um, subjected you or put you in some type of situation where there was too many cooks in the, tr in the kitchen here. I trust you. Okay. This person may trust you. Like I said, this is probably somebody who... They trust you with their life. It's like you're holding their hand strongly. I'm getting like you... It's like you're holding someone's hand and you're guiding them to overcome some type of troubles or maybe you guys need to overcome some type of troubles together because I feel like this is like a reconciliation. Somebody, somebody wants to come and take action towards you here because this is a soulmate type of energy here. This is probably somebody who literally acts like this wolf here, but they're really sweet on the inside here. Very healing type of energy here. It's probably somebody who really has a soft spot for you, okay? Inglewood could be very significant, okay? California could be very significant. Moving too fast, okay? So maybe you guys don't need to move too fast or maybe something was moving too fast. Maybe with this person moving too fast with too many cooks in the kitchen, too, uh, people with other people here. Five, five, five. Five, 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 five could be very significant. There's no time to be distracted. Opportunities to take charge of your life. Um, stay focused. Mute social, me so mute social media. Minimize distraction here. I feel like this is what you guys probably need to do with each other here. Five, 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 five could be very significant here. Okay, I feel like you guys probably need to... Um, Get rid of distractions here. Okay. Five, 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 five. Okay. Warning. A warning is here. Okay. And that's probably the distractions here. Okay. This is conflict and challenges as well. Fives is conflict and challenges this year. I feel like there are too many, too many cooks in the kitchen. I feel like there may be other cooks or other other energies that's trying to intervene in this connection here and they're probably online or something is online that's kind of distracting this person or distracting you or there could be an energy where you guys somebody needs to take charge of their life and kind of like mute out distractions here is what i'm getting here okay so that is a warning okay putting on a show okay i'm strongly getting outside type of energy putting on a show here Okay, yeah. There's some type of deception going on in this connection here. Maybe somebody's not being their self, or I'm strongly getting like some outside forces here. Um, strongly getting um it has a lot to do with somebody's bad habits or their shadow side. Somebody may be living in their shadow side or they don't embrace their shadow side very well. And maybe you do with this Queen of Swords energy, you may embrace your shadow side and and um it, it may be something very graceful to you to be in your shadow side, okay? It may be like um, yin and yang type of energy here. I'm strongly getting like you guys teach each other lessons here. And it's it's very innocent type of lessons here, okay? The number 84 can be very significant. The letter Z can be very significant here, okay? Somebody is like putting on a show. Somebody's wearing a mask in this connection here. They're not being their true self or they're not showing you their true self here like i said this is this wolf energy here okay somebody's showing off or showing that they're there's wolf energy but really they're sweet and soft on the inside okay not saying that they're a soft ass fucking person or they're like a simp or anything this person just has like a sweet side i'm i'm hearing somebody howling at the moon here this person is probably healing that type of energy here is what i'm getting here 
I feel like this is somebody who is changing their mindset here. Okay, hangman energy here. This could be somebody who actually is probably going through a midlife crisis or they're having a timeout or they need to have a timeout, okay? Because I feel like somebody is changing how they see a situation. It's like something has came to a halt. It's like, Aah. it's time for somebody to see something in another perspective or they're kind of forced to actually change how they see a situation here, okay? And it may be a little struggle for this person here with this nine of wands here, Okay? Yeah, but I feel like somebody is better in their self with this king of pen, king of what is, what is this instead? King of presents, king of pentacles energy. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody who probably is just yeah. I feel like they're looking at something at another perspective here, and I feel like they're better in their self. Okay, with this king of pentacles energy here. Yeah, somebody's awakening. They're having a tower moment. They're awakening. Yeah, judgment and tower here. And it's really kind of like out of their control. You got two major arcanas here. This is actually out of somebody's control. This is supposed to happen. Somebody is supposed to have this awakening. It's like with this list here, this is in due time. This is time. Okay, and it's very healthy here. This is a very healthy transforming type of energy here. Okay, this is beautiful. I love seeing this type of energy when somebody is awakening to... Maybe they're calling or they have somebody in their life that helps them heal in some type of way. That's so beautiful. Soulmate energy. This is your soulmate. If this person brings you peace and help you heal and make you feel very content with yourself or reminds you to know your worth or helping you knowing your worth or help you be in this type of reserve type of energy, just being in a very intimate feminine type of energy here. I feel like somebody is probably getting into their feminine side here, okay? Just kind of like, just just being in, in their nurturing type of energy here is beautiful here. But this is definitely some type of reconciliation here. And I feel like you guys probably already done spent lifetimes together. And I feel like a lot of people, a lot of cooks in the kitchen try to intervene and stop this. But obviously, this is like an ace. You got two aces here. I feel like this is like, Something that can't be, I feel like people can't get in the middle of this, okay? Whether people try or not, it's too much love here. And this person trusts you to the moon and back here, okay? Or you trust this person here. But this is Boo Note. Tom, let's know the messages. I hope that these messages resonate with you. Um, if these messages do res resonate with you, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, you guys. I love you guys. Smooches.